there are many problems that we, we all face individually as a family but most of our problems are connected to relationships a relationship is the most difficult problem that we all face in our daily life especially when it comes to our own family members and those who are close to us those who are living with us many people there are there are lots of struggle from the childhood in this relationship problem in relationship with their parents when they are small always there is a problem with the relationship with their parents upset with the parents difficulties with the parents after they are grown up when they are getting married then the relationship with the husband and wife and there is a long time of trouble and problems in relationship with the husband and wife after some time this relationship also this problems also will settle down you know when it is settled down in fact when the children are born born and brought up when children start creating problem the relationship with the husband and wife will be settled down and they have another problem will start the problem with the children relationship with the children and the, how the their behavior character difficulties all these things will disturb them and again after some time they when once they get married their relationship with the in-laws so the relationship problem is the biggest problem praise the lord praise the lord thank you jesus thank you jesus praise you jesus praise you jesus thank you father thank you father and these problems can be sorted out any relationship if there is a problem this problem can be sorted out if there is an altar in between you if you have a problem with the husband and wife if there is an altar in front of you in between you you can sort it out if you have problem with you in you and your children if you have an altar in front of you in between you you can sort it out everywhere any relationship if you have an altar in front of you in between you you can sort out all this problem you know my dear brothers and sisters in the history there are lots of problems happen in the book of bible in the history of the bible there is a big beautiful solution that we see in the bible that is in the book of genesis chapter 22 verse 1 onwards god and abraham had a very beautiful relationship a beautiful relationship and slowly they were building up they were abraham was guided by the lord and as he reached a place then he was praying for a gift of child at the end after 100 years of his life after 25 years of waiting he got a child and the child started growing child started growing 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 and this abraham's life was centered around the child for the first time he got a child of his own and he was so happy to see the child and he was being bringing the child up child grew and the age is growing and when the child became around 37 years old that is when you know that he was depending on his child so much then the lord asked him something chapter 22 was one on words we read like this book of genesis after these things god tested abraham and said to him abraham he said here i am was to and he says he said take your son your only son isaac whom you love so the reason why god is asking this because he loves his son so much more than the whole world more than everything else he loved isaac more than his money more than his wife more than his family more than everything even more than god maybe he loved isaac therefore god said take your son your only son isaac whom you love and go to the land of moriah and offer him there as a burnt offering on one of the mountains that i shall show you my dear brothers and sisters this sentence is a very good answer for all of us take your son take your job take your husband take your wife take your belongings take your body take your image take whatever whom and what you love there are many things that we love so much so dear to us the lord is asking us to destroy it destroy it and surrender it in the hands of god as a burnt offering 
in every relationship there should be an altar where we have to sacrifice whatever we think mine sacrifice it and then go with what god what belongs to god 